Hello guys, um, this is a quick presentation of uh, SnipSled control um, that allows you to control different hardware um, or mic arrays with LEDs um, such as a re-speaker 4 or a re-speaker 2 um, it's just pretty straightforward uh, you install it, uh, you can run it as a service, um, and you have custom LEDs, patterns, yes. cancel. So just let's uh, start straight away with um, re-speaker 4 as a hardware uh, patter pattern is going to be um, Alexa. And let's put a default brightness a bit lower, maybe like... Uh, I don't know, like 25. Jarvis? Yes? What time is it? It is 2.38 p.m. So this um, was the... Um, uh, Amazon Alexa uh, Alexa uh, um, pattern. Let's give a try at maybe Google pattern. It's right here somewhere. Um, let's go to a brightness of maybe 50 for this one. Alice? Yes? What time is it? It is 2.39 p.m. Alice? Yes? What's the weather for tomorrow? Tomorrow the weather is going to be sunny with a temperature of 10.5 degrees around midday and very cloudy with a temperature of 8.4 degrees around 6 p.m. The maximum temperature of the day will be 11 degrees and the minimum 4 degrees. Okay. And we actually also have a um, custom LED pattern. Uh, this was made by uh, K Boston, an uh, early user of uh, SNPs LED control. So let's just quickly pattern type it as custom. Um, well, let's maybe go to 40. Mm. This one is maybe not bright enough. I think his default was 100. Yeah, exactly. This one has um, an idle pattern, uh, meaning it's always showing you that it's actually working. Um, Alice? Yes? What time is it? It is 2.40 p.m. Yeah, and it falls back to the idle. So, um, hope you enjoyed it. Um, that's about it for today. And um, as usual, uh, dev safe. Bye, guys.